Richard Hammond presented Top Gear from 2002 until 2015 alongside Jeremy Clarkson and James May. Wheeler Dealers presenter Mike Brewer has claimed that he is responsible for getting Richard Hammond his job on Top Gear. The 59-year-old patrol head admitted that when the BBC were revamping the globally popular motoring show back in 2001, he was approached to host alongside Jeremy Clarkson. However, the Discovery Channel A tiny weenie channel that had only been going for five years, that were filming gorillas up mountains and people digging for treasure also called. They were offering him his own show, which would become the car-flipping reality series Wheeler Dealers. The little story on the side of this, he's conveniently forgotten, he intimated. Is that Richard Hammond was the press officer for Renault at the time. And they said to me if it's not you, who's it going to be? And I said, have you tried Richard Hammond? He's the press officer for Renault. He's desperate to be on the telly. And they said no. I said I'll phone him for you. So I got Richard into the screen test. And I coached him and coached him after the screen test. And he got the job. He's forgot about that. He might tell it a different way. He was waiting for the phone call. But there was a bit before then where I pitched him to BBC. He revealed on the Wheeler Dealer podcast. Richard went on to host Top Gear with Jeremy and James May from 2002 until 2015. The trio then landed another motoring show, The Grand Tour, on Prime Video which ran from 2016 until 2023. In September 2006, he suffered a significant brain injury following a collision while filming the program. Less than six months later the TV host made a triumphant return to the BBC show with his brain still scrambled, from the accident. However he later admitted he had barely recovered before returning to filming. Richard subsequently suffered a second serious crash, this time while filming the Grand Tour. The terrifying accident made it into the show and was shown in the opening episode of the second series. While driving in Switzerland, Richard lost control of his electric Remitz Concept 1 and was thrown over a cliff. Although he ended up in hospital, his injuries were not severe but the car did burst into flames. Meanwhile, Top Gear was shelved earlier this year after Freddie Flintoff was in a horrific crash. He reached a settlement with the BBC, reportedly worth £9 million.